don't forget, I've got a couple of giveaways going on. If you've checked out the last video about the reviews for the Jordan 13 Red Flint and the Jordan 4, the University Blue, if you've checked out that video, you already know about the giveaway that I'm going to do. Something very, very small. If you can guess what shoe I have on the way. Um, I did get a couple of deliveries today. They are not the shoes that I was referring to. You will know. So it's not too late to go ahead and comment, um, comment below on this video. Get yourself in that giveaway. Also, I still have that giveaway going for um, the sneaker group for the love of sneakers. If you're not in the group, go join the group. It is not too late to enter. I will be doing the giveaway this weekend. Anybody that has commented and followed the instructions on the post, it is um, one of the posts that's tagged to the top. If you join the group and you're not sure about it, post and question about it, somebody will help you figure out where the giveaway entry stuff is. Anyhow, um, I'll be doing that this weekend as well. Everybody that's entered successfully will go up on a wheel. I'll spin it, you know, do the whole giveaway for that. It's a free pair of sneakers, guys. Doesn't get much better than that. Make sure you enter. Baby, it's your girl and I for kicks welcome back to the channel um, in addition to the giveaways that I just mentioned I also am doing an interview this Saturday at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time I am going to be interviewing Dre Jungles and the Trap House they did this super awesome event where they are, you know, bringing attention to the female sneaker heads out there. They did a 10 clip challenge. You show 10 of your favorite pairs of sneakers. And then from that, the women are entered on a wheel and chosen at random for a, like a, a knockout, like a tournament. It's super, super dope. Um, I have the information over here for the two channels. Make sure you check them out. The tournament is going to be fire and it, it's just getting started. So y'all have time to watch the entire thing through. Crazy heat going on there. Shout out to all the female sneaker heads. Um, but yeah, so I will be interviewing these two fellow sneakerhead YouTubers. Super excited to get some insight on, you know, how they got started and everything. Um, but yeah, so as I mentioned, I got a couple shipments in. I am just gonna jump right into getting these open again. These are not the shoes that I talked about. If you guess what I have coming, you can win, you know, I might give away something. These are not the shoes. These I did mention in the last video. Um, if you watched the video all the way through from like beginning to end, I mentioned trying to get not only my size in the Red Flint 13s, but also a pair for my baby sister who's getting ready to graduate high school. I'm just, I'm so excited about this. Um, I also, I'm not even gonna bother showing the tag. It's, y'all already know what it is. So it's the same shoe as I showed in the last video, the Flint 13s. Um, still, I mean, that suede is super soft. Still pretty much the same quality, which doesn't always happen when you have men's size versus grade school. Grade school tends to lose some of the quality. But I gotta say, this is pretty friggin' spot on. I mean, it's identical, just a smaller shoe. So I am super, super, super excited about this. That is a beautiful shoe. Let's go ahead and get an on foot look of these beauties.
Let me just go ahead and open this. I don't know why they gave such a huge box for this, like unnecessary. Let me go ahead and open this. Um, again, as I mentioned in my last video, there was like a delay in confirmation um, from this, for this shoe. Guys, I don't know what this is, um, but all right, so this is clearly not the Flint's, so I mean, I'm sure I can read it and figure out what it is, but let's go ahead and open it and find out, and oh my god. So, um... Yeah, I'm kind of at a loss for words right now. There is another shoe. I've kind of been greedy with it. I'm not going to lie to y'all. I haven't mentioned this shoe in any of my videos because I don't want a ton of people knowing about it. Um, Because I wanted to be able to get it. I've been eyeing it for the longest time. And yeah, it's here. So it's, it's this blazer and it's got this beautiful little pomegranate embroidered on the side of it I mean it's absolutely freaking gorgeous they've got like the cork detail on the back and it's it's kind of like it's it's like a textbook you know little illustration type of you know it's a botany inspired theme that Nike has going on they actually have um, an indigo pair that they're doing. They have a couple Air Force Ones that they have coming out. I really, I mean, this was this was before the Ready Made Blazer dropped. I saw this and wanted it, so I'm I'm actually holding this shoe, and this is crazy. So yeah, clearly these are not my little sister's um, Red Flint 13s. I'm still kind of in awe of the fact that I have this shoe. Um, so yeah, if you guys haven't done so already, make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Make sure you hit that notification bell. Guys, if you haven't noticed, I'm always doing giveaways. I love the opportunity to give back to the sneaker community, but you're gonna miss those giveaways if you don't hit that notification bell. Make sure you show your girls some love, like the videos and comment below. I love getting the feedback from you all. You are all so amazing. We're still on the road to a thousand subscribers. Of course, you know, that there there's never a limit. I always go more than that. But once we hit a thousand subscribers, I'm gonna do another giveaway and it will be a mystery box with a guaranteed retro Jordan. Say what? The sneaker giveaway this time is not guaranteed a retro Jordan, but it is guaranteed a sneaker to the winner in their size. Um, guys, we've broken 500 subscribers because you are all so, so amazing. I appreciate all your continued support and make sure you keep tuning in to see what I've got my eye on next.